so we have a little turtle here with some shell rock going on already been able to scrub at this with a little bit of a toothbrush here um, using a peroxide based shampoo to help dry and lift any of those old scutes that are attached uh, down at the bottom here where it looks pinkish um, I'll still have to work on that and especially around the caudal end of the shell you can see there's some old scutes attached um, it's pretty basic you just sit there and scrub with a toothbrush and the old scutes as you can see will start to lift and then we will have a solution to uh, what is an ongoing problem partially behavior based because we don't bask like we should um, maybe this turtle was kept in an enclosure that was too cold before I'm not sure I don't know history a hundred percent on this little sweetie but um, on the back I've been able to scrub a bit and we've got an almost normal looking skewed over here on the dorsal right side um, same thing with the uh, dorsal midline we're getting some progress here um, all these old pieces need to go um, for him to be able to shed these scutes normally I should say her I believe no maybe we are gonna be a male hard to tell at this point in the game um, even looking at the tail we're gonna hide the tail so uh, as they're developing I can look and usually tell if the uh, vent is more caudally placed it's gonna be a male if it's more um, towards the body we're gonna see that this is gonna be a female so I'm seeing some pretty good nail development so I think I've got a male on my hands all right guys well best of luck be sure to scrub these things off this is a basic nursing skill um, you can even see I can loosen some of it with the thumbnail just be very careful if there's actually any areas where there are uh, infections underneath those scutes it will be very squishy that's your point at which you need to stop and get a hold of your doctor and say hey uh, what would you like for this a lot of times they'll choose things like uh, silver sulfadiazine ointment or some other thing and of course uh, dry docking this guy setting him up with a really nice especially ceramic heat emitter source Oh, he's mad um, overnight is gonna make a world of difference because you'll see them and they'll be exfoliating the next day so all right guys good luck and uh, happy scrubbing <laughs>